Bastard is here. We're going to run a drinking pot for you. Oh, there you are. Feel free to complain below after first. Subscribing and liking, so get a troll at your convenience because your notifications will be sent to you and I have new videos. So you can insist, I could do better than that. Oh, you suck. Or oh, my grandmother. I don't know. I'm not non trolling myself, so subscribe, like. So you can commentate below like a complete asshole at your convenience. Let's talk about today's product. It's grape flavored. It's Americans will roll their eyes and cry, ah, that's American. No, because you can also get it in Korea and Japan. Actually, I'm sure most Americans will miss the point. It's a huge military business and I've had a word. Ugh, like that. No, I'm not excited. Just straight here. Who oh, those brains are in that part of the world? Yes, it is that simple. This, come on now, you know it, it's a Japanese version. So you're totally being Japanese, or getting, or whatever the hell that miserable 80s song is. It's an ashy Welsh's sparkling 50% grape juice. Oh, look at that dark, dark color, Barugin. Or officially, what was holding the sparkling? As a nutritional panel and ingredients has to say for itself. It's like this has been officially imported to the land of Australia. As I have my favorite auto channel calls this cesspit of a nation. And it is a real cesspit. Trust me. Right, let's crack this monster open. It's 50% grape juice. Woo wee! It's going to be sweet, especially with Japanese stands. That is going to be a ball buster. It smells like Concord grape. Getting a bit of that sulfuric sweetness from the white grape. That's why at first it's almost a touch fermented, but no, it's the white grape. Have a sip. Tastes like booze. Yep. This tastes like wine. Now, for a housing joke for you internationals out there, it tastes like cheap, cheap wine. <laughs> now, you may not know what that joke is because that's a very Asian. Um, either pub rock band, yet again a very Anopedian phrase, called uh, Cold Chisel, and one of the most infamous songs is Cheap Cheap Wine. And they are such cult heroes amongst the uh, working class uh, trailer trash, as uh, the American phrase Bowman's goes, that uh, their songs aren't merely famous, they're infamous. And this is like Cheap Cheap Wine, so it's not going to be able to explain it, but I should try to make these videos for as broad as possible as an audience. And such an inside joke does need explanation. You get all the flavour and the body and the <clears throat> well, the Concord grape, mm, even the aftertaste. Oh, 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 oh. That's why I love Concord grape, the aftertaste. Oh my god, it's even better than the natural grape. And then you got this horrific, acidic, sulfurous, white grape blended in that I swear to God, what a quasi fermenter is. It's got a bit hot because it, it, it's almost like a holic in its, in its the dryness of its acidity. It's like white wine. It's so dry, it's so crisp, but it's still strangely fruity. You buy with the Concord grape because that's a witch's thing. They're the Concord grape guys. It's um, 
honest to God, it tastes like a wine product. It's maybe a wine spritzer. Yeah, you, you get a can of this, pour it in a little champagne flute, and you ship it away while taking your significant other on an adorable little picnic date. Um, better than a soft drink. And by Germany's standards, I'm going to admit the sweetness is actually quite reasonable because it tastes so much like booze. You, know, you really wouldn't notice or care about the sweetness. By Western standards, it's, um, it's irritating to the point of being piffy. Sweetness is barely noticeable. God, that's irritating. Um, yet again, because it tastes so much like booze. So this... Um, I don't to watch this video. This probably would have been long gone for the best part of a year. <laughs> probably. Um, from shows and it may or may not ever come back. That's literally part of the fun, one could argue. If it does, and uh, you want to know what it's like to get drink wine product, but I don't know, you're in um, an Islamic part of the world or you're under the age of drinking, legal age of uh, alcoholism, give this a spin. It's, um, it's frighteningly similar. And in a um, off-putting note, uh, get busted out of here.